now we are going to see multiply with grouping before that we have seen multiplying without grouping okay so we are going to multiply again two digit number 28 into 32 so multiply by the ones step one so what you're going to do first one tens that is place value you have to write according to the place value you have to write the number 2 8 28 3 2 32 so multiply by the ones so 28 is going to multiply by 32 in the ones place what is the number is here 2 so we are going to multiply 28 into 2 ones that is what 28 into 2 ones 2 I have written so 8 twos are that means 2 eights are you are going to multiply by 2 so I have to say 2 table otherwise you can say 8 table which is your convenience you can do that but 8 table is a bigger number so I you I choose because 28 is going to multiply by 2 ones that is what I have taken 2 table okay 2 into 8 16 so what you are going to write you must say what is this 2 ones are 2 2 twos are 4 2 threes are 6 2 fours are 8 2 fives are 10 and uh, 2 6 are 12 2 sevens are 18 2 eights are 16 16 so what is the number 16 means 28 into 2 you can get what 16 28 into 2 so 2 eights are 16 so 2 eights are 16 you can get 2 eights are 16 so 16 means what is the six ones so six ones and one tens okay six ones and one tens so six i've written here so one is go to the what tens place okay the carryover this is called one tens is a carryover is go to the tens place two twos are four four plus one five this is what okay 56 so the answer is 56 see look at this sum okay this is i told you what with grouping so so i have written each step by step okay first 28 ones tens that is sorry you must write the place value first sorry ones and tens you must write and 2 8 28 and 3 2 what 32 so 28 is going to multiply by what 2 so 28 is going to multiply by 2 ones so 2 8s are 16 6 the carrier is go to the what tens place so next step what is this so again 28 and 32 so 2 8s are 16 and carrier is go to the what tens place and 2 2s are 4 4 plus 1 5 so 56 so multiply the one is over so again bring down the third step the 28 and 32 what i've written see again you have to write 28 is going to multiply sorry you are already multiplied by 2 28 already multiplied by 2 the answer is 56 now you're going to what do step 2 multiply by the tens so what you're going to do before going to multiply by the tens you have to put what zero in the ones place this is ones and tens so ones place already over so you have to put one you have to put zero in the ones place so that is what i have what put zero the next step what i'm going to do this this are all what with the grouping steps so again i have to write 28 into 32 so you have to write as it is the 56 ones place what 28 if you multiply by 2, you can get already multiplied. The answer is 56 and 1's place also what 0. So now you are going to multiply what? That is by 10. Okay. That is what? Multiply by the 10's. 10's place what is the number? 3 tens. Okay. That is what? 3 tens. So 3 eights are. You must say the 3 table up to 8. So 3 eights are means 1 3's are 3, 2 3's are 6, 3 3's are 9, 3 4's are 12, 3 5's are 15, 3 6's are 18, 3 7's are 21. 3 8s are 24 so you must already put 0 in the ones place this 24 that means 3 into 8 24 that is what 4 tens and 200 so 4 tens you must this 4 tens you must write it in the tens place that is what 4 okay 4 then again you have to bring down you must write as it is 28 into 32 so one's place value already 56 and then what one's place is over that is what you have to put zero and tens place you have started so what three eights are 24 so four tens <coughs> four tens and 200 so this carryover is go to this this corner so the remaining three eights are 24 that is what four tens and 200 carryover is go to the two 
and does this carry over is go to the corner so 3 2s are 6 okay 3 2s are 6 6 plus 2 what 8 so this is 8 hundreds this is over so next what you write what you have to put the arrow mark again so again you have to write 28 and 32 so once place okay if you multiply first you multiply by once you got the answer you have to write the 56 whatever step by step so 56 you must write continuously 56 have written and once place there is no because once place is over that is what i have put zero in the ones place then i started multiplying by tens place that means i have multiplied 28 into 3 tens that is 30 that is what that is 3 tens so 3 into 824 the 4 and carry over is 2 i have written already here so you must write it also here so what is this and 2 3s are 6 6 plus 2 8 so this is 8 hundreds so that is what you have written now you are going to add both numbers so 6 plus 0 6 5 plus 4 9 because 5 in the mind and 4 in the finger after what 5 6 7 8 9 9 and 8 you must bring down as it is the answer is 896 so multiplying by the tens already once answer is 56 then so again you have to know that that is multiply by tens that is what how you know that how are you going to multiply you can see <coughs> are you going to multiply by tens i have expand everything step by step so i have written very simply that is three four three sorry three uh, three tens three tens is that is 28 is going to multiply by three that means three tens that is what i have written 28 into 30 so 56 means nothing but that is 28 that is 2 8 28 and 3 2 32 that is 28 first you step 1 28 is multiplied by 2 once that is what 28 into 2 you can get this answer 56 so here also you can get this answer okay 56 okay next what uh, what i've done it that is you have to multiply by 10 that is 3 tens, 3 tens means 30, 3 into 10, 30, so 28 is multiplied by 3 tens, so you know that very well, so once place, there is no number, so you have to put 0, and 3 eights are 24, I have told you very clearly, so 4 must, 2, 24 means, 24 means what, 4 tens and 2 hundreds, so 4 tens, so 4 I have written in the tens place, the remaining carry over, it is in the hundred place, because there is no number, just write, then the 100 place, then 2, 3 is a 6, 6 plus 2, what, 8. Then you have to add everything, you have to add everything. So 6 plus 0, 6, 5 plus 4, 9 and 8 you have to write. So 28 into 2, 56 and 28 into 30, 840. Then 28 into 32, you can get this answer, 896. This is the right answer for the question. <clears throat> I think so you understand very clearly this is all step by step it's a very big process this is a with grouping method so <clears throat> i suggest without grouping you have taken take as a simple method of course if you uh, use this method you can you can take long time it's a very long process but without any mistake you can do it I i'll tell you assure i surely i'll tell you i'm give the assurance i'll tell you very surely definitely you can't do any what mistakes if you take this method but with it's a very long process a delaying process with grouping so i suggest without grouping it is a normal multiplication better you choose that method it is a short process and simple process also but you must thorough in the tables and also you have to concentrate more while you practice more and more you will get a what you will, you will get a thorough in the concept and without doing any mistake, you can easily do the multiplication, even two digit or three digit, whatever it may be. So you you are doing multiply with grouping. The number is twenty eight and thirty two. The answer is eight hundred and ninety six. So we can check all the methods properly. So the answer is I've written again in the box. It seems so. Answer is eight nine six eight hundred and ninety six. That is eight hundred and nine tens and six ones. Eight nine six. That is eight hundred ninety six. The right answer for the question.